Hi guys, so today's video is going to be a review on this hair. This is um, deep curly hair and um, the lengths I have in are 226 and 228 inches as well. Um, I'm wearing, I made this into a wig. Um, I used Ivy's flip over method, I'll put that down below and that's kind of how I did the flip over. Um, and I'm going to just get straight into it. I'm going to try and make this quite short because there isn't that much to say. I've had this hair for quite a long time now. I've been wearing it off camera mostly because I wanted to. I wanted you guys to see it now and not before. Um, and that's the beauty of these wigs that you make. Like you can just take them off and just put them on. So I've been wearing this quite a lot. So I'm going to just start. This hair didn't take very long to come at all. This came by DHL. Um, everything came fine i think the package came within three to four days the hair came packaged really really nicely and i've got a really nice free gift as well i'm going to just come close so you guys can see the curl pattern this is what it looks like it's really really pretty and it's really long this is a 28 inch and it comes around there um first thing i did was i dyed it black then i um co-washed it with um garnier fruit teas for um repair and shine i think it's called conditioner it's the orange one um, I did that and I had I did get a little bit of shedding um, when I washed it but that's because it's curly hair you know curly hair does shed a bit more than um, normal hair but it wasn't anything too much um, however after it was dried and everything I didn't experience much shedding at all after that the hair was really really good and it didn't shed much um, this hair to me it hasn't tangled so much you guys can see that this hair isn't matted the only place it does tangle and get matted a little bit is at the back here where it rubs on like back of my neck and my necklaces and all that kind of stuff so um yeah as long as you're detangling i'll go into detangling anyway but as long as you're detangling regularly um there shouldn't be an issue for you this hair hasn't tangled for me so far it's still the curls are still really nice and it hasn't matted up or anything so i'd give tangling a two out of ten thickness this is only four bundles of hair guys and you can see that it's super super full if i bring like this to the front you guys can see how full it is and it's really nice and thick so thickness i'd give it like a nine out of ten because it's super thick but then again curly hair is thicker than um straight hair it's just a lot thicker and you get a lot more you don't have to brush it every day it's not um hair that you just sit there and brush and comb however i would recommend detangling it two or three times a week to avoid it matting up because um with curly hair you have to kind of look after it and i detangle this i brush this hair um every night before i go to bed and i detangle it properly maybe three times a week depending on how much i'm wearing it just for normal maintenance i normally just spray water on it the this is afro g leave-in conditioner but it's just got plain water in it and i literally just spray it all over my hair like this and i get the ends and i spray it and i just scrunch it up like that um and that's kind of what I do to just like define the curls a bit more and to make it look um, hydrated. I would recommend putting like a drop of like any oil of your choice, maybe like argan oil or castor oil or amla oil or something like that, just so that as you're spraying your hair throughout the day, you're not drying out the hair because obviously water does um, dry out hair if you don't like have a moisturizer to seal it. Yeah. The, I like this hair because it's not too shiny. Um, it doesn't look synthetic at all. It looks quite natural. I like that. The, the luster is quite low and it's not very shiny because I'm not really a fan of shiny curly hair I prefer it to be like more like matte I don't know if you can use matte to describe hair but um I, hope, I think you guys know what I mean yeah so overall this hair has been great um I the only two products that I've been using on it are water and um, with a drop of armlet oil as well as um my conditioner which is the Garnier um, repair and shine which is the orange one and it hasn't caused me any problems so far and um, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like from the back so you guys can see and um, as you can see from that it's got a lot of movement as well which I really really like um, so yeah I think that's about it really um, I don't think it's too expensive the price I'll put down the links down below um, some of you messaged me asking if I would do a review on another company's curly hair so I did and just make sure you condition it do deep conditions here and there um, but I have to say that I haven't been sleeping with this hair on because I've made this wig with the elastic band method so I've literally got an elastic band around here um, and it just sits on my head and I just take it off when I go to bed um, I might try sleeping on the hair for about a week and then if there's any significant changes I'll put them in the down bar however I do not like sleeping with hair touching me so I don't know if I will do that but hopefully I might hopefully I'll do it yeah that's pretty much it um so just to recap i'd give shedding a three out of ten i'd give tangling a two out of ten and i'd give thickness a nine out of ten because the hair is really really thick um make sure you detangle regularly and make sure that you use a conditioner that um 
that a good conditioner basically i'd recommend anything from like herbal essences or garnier so um yeah that's this review i really hope you guys enjoyed it if you have any questions please leave them down below and i will get back to you and i'll see you guys in the next one bye